Basque, Euskara EUS, Ka, is a language spoken in the Basque country, a region that straddles the westernmost Pyrenees in adjacent parts of northern Spain and southwestern France. Linguistically, Basque is unrelated to the other languages of Europe and is a language isolate to any other known living language. The Basques are indigenous to, and primarily inhabit, the Basque country. The Basque language is spoken by 28.4% of Basques in all territories. Of these, 93.2% are in the Spanish area of the Basque country and the remaining 6.8% are in the French portion. Native speakers live in a contiguous area that includes parts of four Spanish provinces and the three ancient provinces in France. Givercoa, most of Biscay, a few municipalities of Oliva, and the northern area of Navarre formed the core of the remaining Basque-speaking area before measures were introduced in the 1980s to strengthen the language. By contrast, most of Oliva, the western part of Biscay and central and southern areas of Navarre are predominantly populated by native speakers of Spanish, either because Basque was replaced by Spanish over the centuries, in some areas most of Oliva and central Navarre, or because it was possibly never spoken there, in other areas parts of the Encartere and southeastern Navarre. Under Restorationist and Francoist Spain, public use of Basque was frowned upon, often regarded as a sign of separatism. This applied especially to those regions that did not support Franco's uprising, such as Biscay or Givercoa. Overall, in the 1960s and later, the trend reversed and education and publishing in Basque began to flourish. As a part of this process, a standardized form of the Basque language, called Euskara Batua, was developed by the Euskaltsa India in the late 1960s. Besides its standardized version, the five historic Basque dialects are Biscayan, Givercoan, and Upper Navarrese in Spain, and Navarrese Lepardian and Solitan in France. They take their names from the historic Basque provinces, but the dialect boundaries are not congruent with province boundaries. Euskara Batua was created so that Basque language could be used and easily understood by all Basque speakers in formal situations, education, mass media, literature, and this is its main use today. In both Spain and France, the use of Basque for education varies from region to region and from school to school. A language isolate, Basque is believed to be one of the few surviving pre Indo European languages in Europe, and is the only one in Western Europe. The origin of the Basques and of their languages is not conclusively known, though the most accepted current theory is that early forms of Basque developed before the arrival of Indo European languages in the area, including the Romance languages that geographically surround the Basque speaking region. Basque has adopted a good deal of its vocabulary from the Romance languages, and Basque speakers have in turn lent their own words to Romance speakers. The Basque alphabet uses the Latin script. Topic. Names of the language In Basque, the name of the language is officially Euskara alongside various dialect forms. In French, the language is normally called Basque, though in recent times Euskara has become common. Spanish has a greater variety of names for the language. Today, it is most commonly referred to as El Vasco, La Lengua Vasca, or El Euskara. Both terms, Vasco and Basque, are inherited from Latin ethnonym Vascones, which in turn goes back to the Greek term Washkonis an ethnonym used by Strabo in his Geographica 23 CE, Book 3. The Spanish term vascuance, derived from Latin vasconis, has acquired negative connotations over the centuries and is not well liked amongst Basque speakers generally. Its use is documented at least as far back as the 14th century when a law passed in Huesca in 1349 stated that item nul corridor nancha usado que fega mercaderia ninguna que compre nin venda entre ningunas personas, falando en algaravia nin en abrache nin en basquenque, et qui lo fara pog por coto xxx sol. Essentially penalizing the use of Arabic, Hebrew, or Basque in marketplaces with a fine of 30 souls, the equivalent of 30 sheep. History and classification Basque is geographically surrounded by Romance languages but is a language isolate unrelated to them, and indeed, to any other language in the world. It is the last remaining descendant of one of the pre-Indo-European languages of Western Europe, the others being extinct outright. 
Consequently, its prehistory may not be reconstructable by means of the traditional comparative method except by applying it to differences between dialects within the language. Little is known of its origins, but an early form of the Basque language likely was present in Western Europe before the arrival of the Indo-European languages to the area. Authors such as Miguel de Unamuno and Louis Lucien Bonaparte have noted that the words for knife, ito, axe, iskora, and ho, aitzer, derive from the word for stone, hates, and have therefore concluded that the language dates to prehistoric Europe when those tools were made of stone. Others find this unlikely, see the Iskora controversy. Latin inscriptions in Gallia Aquitania preserve a number of words with cognates in the reconstructed Proto-Basque language, for instance, the personal names Nescato and Sison Nescato and Gizan mean young girl and man, respectively in modern Basque. This language is generally referred to as Aquitanian and is assumed to have been spoken in the area before the Roman Republic's conquests in the Western Pyrenees. Some authors even argue for late Basquization, that the language moved westward during late antiquity after the fall of the Western Roman Empire into the northern part of Hispania into what is now Basque country. Roman neglect of this area allowed Aquitanian to survive while the Iberian and Tartessian languages became extinct. Through the long contact with Romance languages, Basque adopted a sizable number of Romance words. Initially the source was Latin, later Gascon a branch of Occitan in the northeast, Navarro-Aragonese in the southeast and Spanish in the southwest. Topic. Hypotheses concerning Basque's connections to other languages The statistical improbability and chronological difficulty of linking Basque with its Indo-European neighbors in Europe has inspired many scholars to search for its possible relatives elsewhere. Besides many pseudoscientific comparisons, the appearance of long-range linguistics gave rise to several attempts to connect Basque with geographically very distant language families. Almost all hypotheses concerning the origin of Basque are controversial, and the suggested evidence is not generally accepted by most linguists. Some of these hypothetical connections are Iberian, another ancient language once spoken in the Iberian Peninsula, shows several similarities with Aquitanian and Basque. However, not enough evidence exists to distinguish geographical connections from linguistic ones. Iberian itself remains unclassified. Eduardo Orduña Aznar claims to have established correspondences between Basque and Iberian numerals and noun case markers. Indo-European, possibly close to Italo Celtic or an Indo-European Creole possibly with a donor language akin to Britonic on a substrate language akin to Italic. Forney considers it unrealistic that Basque is a non-Indo-European language that allegedly borrowed the majority of its basic lexicon including virtually all verbs and most of its archaic bound morphemes from neighboring Indo-European languages. In response, a non-Indo-European line of descent with waves or stages of Indo-European influence and minor discontinuities over probably millennia before the Roman conquest was suggested as the most likely alternative by John T. Koch in his review of Forney's paper outlining why an Indo-European classification of Basque cannot be accepted, even if some of Forney's data is accepted. Vasconic substratum theory, this proposal, made by the German linguist Theo Venman, claims that enough toponymical evidence exists to conclude that Basque is the only survivor of a larger family that once extended throughout most of Western Europe, and has also left its mark in modern Indo-European languages spoken in Europe. Ligurian substrate, this hypothesis proposed in the 19th century by Darbois de Jubainville, J. Pokorny, P. Kretschmer and several other linguists encompasses the Bosco-Iberian hypothesis. Georgian, linking Basque to the Kartvelian languages is now widely discredited. The hypothesis was inspired by the existence of the ancient kingdom of Iberia in the Caucasus and further by some typological similarities between the two languages. According to J. P. Mallory, the hypothesis was also inspired by a Basque place name ending in DZE which is common in Kartvelian. The theory suggested that Basque and Georgian were remnants of a pre-Indo-European group. Northeast Caucasian, such as Chechen, are seen by some linguists as more likely candidates for a very distant connection. Dene Caucasian, based on the possible Caucasian link, some linguists, for example John Benson and Merritt Rulin, have proposed including Basque in the Dene Caucasian superfamily of languages, but this proposed superfamily includes languages from North America and Eurasia, and its existence is highly controversial. 
Dogon, the philologist Javier Martín Martín investigated on the subject and states that Basque is derived from Dogon, spoken in northwestern Africa. This claim has been harshly contested by Shabir Quintana of the Uskaltz India, who says that this theory makes no sense and consists of cheap speculation and criticizes the lack of methodology. Topic. Geographic distribution The region where Basque is spoken has become smaller over centuries, especially at the northern, southern, and eastern borders. Nothing is known about the limits of this region in ancient times, but on the basis of toponyms and epigraphs, it seems that in the beginning of the Common Era it stretched to the river Garonne in the north including the southwestern part of present-day France, at least to the Val d'Aran in the east now a Gascon-speaking part of Catalonia, including lands on both sides of the Pyrenees, the southern and western boundaries are not clear at all. The Reconquista temporarily counteracted this contracting tendency when the Christian lords called on northern Iberian peoples, Basques, Asturians, and Franks to colonize the new conquests. The Basque language became the main everyday language, while other languages like Spanish, Gascon, French, or Latin were preferred for the administration and high education. By the 16th century, the Basque-speaking area was reduced basically to the present-day seven provinces of the Basque country, excluding the southern part of Navarre, the southwestern part of Oliva, and the western part of Biscay, and including some parts of Bayern. In 1807, Basque was still spoken in the northern half of Oliva, including its capital city Vitoria Gastes, and a vast area in central Navarre, but in these two provinces, Basque experienced a rapid decline that pushed its border northwards. In the French Basque country, Basque was still spoken in all the territory except in Bayonne and some villages around, and including some bordering towns in Bayern. In the 20th century, however, the rise of Basque nationalism spurred increased interest in the language as a sign of ethnic identity, and with the establishment of autonomous governments in the southern Basque country, it has recently made a modest comeback. In the Spanish part, Basque language schools for children and Basque teaching centers for adults have brought the language to areas such as Encartere and the Ribera d'Ebre in Navarre, where it is not known if it has ever been spoken before, and in the French Basque country, these schools and centers have almost stopped the decline of the language. Topic. Official status Historically, Latin or Romance languages have been the official languages in this region. However, Basque was explicitly recognized in some areas. For instance, the Fuero or Charter of the Basque colonized Oje Castro now in La Rioja allowed the inhabitants to use Basque in legal processes in the 13th and 14th centuries. The Spanish Constitution of 1978 states in Article 3 that the Spanish language is the official language of the nation, but allows autonomous communities to provide a co-official language status for the other languages of Spain. Consequently, the Statute of Autonomy of the Basque Autonomous Community establishes Basque as the co-official language of the autonomous community. The Statute of Navarre establishes Spanish as the official language of Navarre, but grants co-official status to the Basque language in the Basque-speaking areas of northern Navarre. Basque has no official status in the French Basque country and French citizens are barred from officially using Basque in a French court of law. However, the use of Basque by Spanish nationals in French courts is permitted, with translation, as Basque is officially recognized on the other side of the border. The positions of the various existing governments differ with regard to the promotion of Basque in areas where Basque is commonly spoken. The language has official status in those territories that are within the Basque Autonomous Community, where it is spoken and promoted heavily, but only partially in Navarre. The Ley del Vascuence, Law of Basque, seen as contentious by many Basques, but considered fitting Navarra's linguistic and cultural diversity by some of the main political parties of Navarre, divides Navarre into three language areas, Basque-speaking, non-Basque-speaking, and mixed. Support for the language and the linguistic rights of citizens vary, depending on the area. Others consider it unfair, since the rights of Basque speakers differ greatly depending on the place they live. Topic. Demographics. The 2006 Sociolinguistic Survey of All Basque-Speaking Territories showed that in 2006, of all people aged 16 and above, 
In the Basque Autonomous Community, 30.1% were fluent Basque speakers, 18.3% passive speakers and 51.5% did not speak Basque. The percentage was highest in Givercoa, 49.1% speakers and lowest in Oliva, 14.2%. These results represent an increase from previous years 29.5% in 2001, 27.7% in 1996 and 24.1% in 1991. The highest percentage of speakers can now be found in the 16 to 24 age range 57.5% versus 25.0% in the 65 plus age range. The percentage of fluent speakers is even higher if counting those under 16, given that the proportion of bilinguals is particularly high in this age group 76.7% .7 of those aged between 10 and 14 and 72.4% of those aged 5 to 9, 37.5% of the population aged 6 and above in the whole Basque Autonomous Community, 25.0% in Oliva, 31.3% in Biscay and 53.3% in Givercoa. In French Basque Country, 22.5% were fluent Basque speakers, 8.6% passive speakers, and 68.9% did not speak Basque. The percentage was highest in Labord and Seoul, 55.5% speakers, and lowest in the Bayonne Anglet Biarritz Conurbation, 8.8%. These results represent another decrease from previous years, 24.8% in 2001 and 26.4 in 1996. The highest percentage of speakers is in the 65 plus age range 32.4%. The lowest percentage is found in the 25 to 34 age range 11.6%, but there is a slight increase in the 16 to 24 age range 16.1%. In Navarre, 11.1% were fluent Basque speakers, 7.6% passive speakers, and 81.3% did not speak Basque. The percentage was highest in the Basque speaking zone in the north, 60.1% speakers, and lowest in the non-Basque speaking zone in the south, 1.9%. These results represent a slight increase from previous years, 10.3% in 2001, 9.6% in 1996, and 9.5% in 1991. The highest percentage of speakers can now be found in the 16 to 24 age range, 19.1% versus 9.1% in the 65 plus age range. Taken together, in 2006, of a total population of 2,589,600, 1,850,500 in the autonomous community, 230,200 in the northern provinces, and 508,900 in Navarre, 665,800 spoke Basque aged 16 and above. This amounts to 25.7% Basque bilinguals overall, 15.4% passive speakers, and 58.9% non-speakers. Compared to the 1991 figures, this represents an overall increase of 137,000, from 528,500 from a population of 2,371,100 15 years previously. The 2011 figures show an increase of some 64,000 speakers compared to the 2006 figures to 714,136, with significant increases in the autonomous community, but a slight drop in the northern Basque country to 51,000 100, overall amounting to an increase to 27% of all inhabitants of Basque provinces 2,648,998 in total. Basque is used as a language of commerce both in the Basque country and in locations around the world where Basques immigrated throughout history. Topic. Dialects The modern Basque dialects show a high degree of dialectal divergence, sometimes making cross-dialect communication difficult. This is especially true in the case of Biscayan and Solitan, which are regarded as the most divergent Basque dialects. Modern Basque dialectology distinguishes five dialects Biscayan or Western Givercoan or Central Upper Navarrese navarro Lepardian. Solitan Zuberoan. These dialects are divided in 11 subdialects, and 24 minor varieties among them. According to Koldo Zuazo, the Biscayan dialect or Western is the most widespread dialect, with around 300,000 speakers out of a total of around 660,000 speakers. 
This dialect is divided in two minor sub-dialects, the Western Biscayan and Eastern Biscayan, plus transitional dialects. Influence on other languages Although the influence of the neighboring Romance languages on the Basque language especially the lexicon, but also to some degree Basque phonology and grammar has been much more extensive, it is usually assumed that there has been some feedback from Basque into these languages as well. In particular Gascon and Aragonese, and to a lesser degree Spanish are thought to have received this influence in the past. In the case of Aragonese and Gascon, this would have been through substrate interference following language shift from Aquitanian or Basque to a Romance language, affecting all levels of the language, including place names around the Pyrenees. Although a number of words of alleged Basque origin in the Spanish language are circulated, e.g., anchoa, anchovies, bizarro, dashing, gallant, spirited, cachorro, puppy, etc., most of these have more easily explicable Romance etymologies or not particularly convincing derivations from Basque. Ignoring cultural terms, there is one strong loanword candidate, Ezker, long considered the source of the Pyrenean and Iberian Romance words for left side, Esquierdo, Esquerdo, Esquare. The lack of initial r in Gascon could arguably be due to a Basque influence, but this issue is under researched. The other most commonly claimed substrate influences the Old Spanish merger of v and b, the simple five vowel system. Change of initial f into h, e.g. fabler oblar, with Old Basque lacking f but having h. Voiceless alveolar retracted sibilant s, a sound transitional between laminodental s and palatal. This sound also influenced other Ibero-Romance languages and Catalan. The first two features are common. Widespread developments in many Romance and non-Romance languages. The change of f to h occurred historically only in a limited area, Gascony and Old Castile, that corresponds almost exactly to areas where heavy Basque bilingualism is assumed, and as a result has been widely postulated and equally strongly disputed. Substrate theories are often difficult to prove, especially in the case of phonetically plausible changes like f to h. As a result, although many arguments have been made on both sides, the debate largely comes down to the a priori tendency on the part of particular linguists to accept or reject substrate arguments. Examples of arguments against the substrate theory, and possible responses Spanish did not fully shift, f, to, h, instead, it has preserved, f, before consonants such as, with and, Cf fuerte, fente, on the other hand, the occurrence of f in these words might be a secondary development from an earlier sound such as h or and learned words or words influenced by written Latin form. Gascon does have h in these words, which might reflect the original situation. Evidence of Arabic loanwords in Castilian points to f continuing to exist long after a Basque substrate might have had any effect on Castilian. On the other hand, the occurrence of f in these words might be a late development. Many languages have come to accept new phonemes from other languages after a period of significant influence. For example, French lost h, but later regained it as a result of Germanic influence, and has recently gained as a result of English influence. Basque regularly developed Latin f into b. The same change also occurs in parts of Sardinia, Italy and the Romance languages of the Balkans where no Basque substrate can be reasonably argued for. On the other hand, the fact that the same change might have occurred elsewhere independently does not disprove substrate influence. Furthermore, parts of Sardinia also have prothetic a, or e, before initial r, just as in Basque and Gascon, which may actually argue for some type of influence between both areas. Beyond these arguments, a number of nomadic groups of Castile are also said to use or have used Basque words in their jargon, such as the Gasseria in Segovia, the Mingana, the Galician Falados Arcainas, and the Asturian Chiriga. Part of the Romani community in the Basque country speaks Aramintexela, which is a rare mixed language, with a Calderish Romani vocabulary and Basque grammar. <laughs> Basque pigeons A number of Basque-based or Basque-influenced pigeons have existed. In the 16th century, Basque sailors used a Basque Icelandic pigeon in their contacts with Iceland. The Algonquian Basque pigeon arose from contact between Basque whalers and the Algonquian peoples in the Gulf of St. Lawrence and Strait of Belle Isle. <laughs> Grammar Basque is an ergative absolutive language. 
The subject of an intransitive verb is in the absolutive case which is unmarked, and the same case is used for the direct object of a transitive verb. The subject of the transitive verb is marked differently, with the ergative case shown by the suffix k. This also triggers main and auxiliary verbal agreement. The auxiliary verb, which accompanies most main verbs, agrees not only with the subject, but with any direct object and the indirect object present. Among European languages, this polypersonal agreement is found only in Basque, some languages of the Caucasus, Mordvinic languages, Hungarian, and Maltese all non-Indo-European. The ergative absolutive alignment is also rare among European languages, occurring only in some languages of the Caucasus, but not infrequent worldwide. Consider the phrase Martinic Egunkariak Arasandiskat. Martin ek is the agent transitive subject, so it is marked with the ergative case ending k with an epenthetic e. Egunkariak has an ak ending, which marks plural object, plural absolutive, direct object case. The verb is arasandiskat, in which arasan is a kind of gerund, buying, and the auxiliary diskat means he, she does them for me. This diskat can be split like this. D is used in the present tense when the verb has a subject ergative, a direct object absolutive, and an indirect object, and the object is him, her, it, them. Zki means the absolutive in this case the newspapers is plural, if it were singular there would be no infix, and T or da means to me, for me, indirect object. In this instance there is no suffix after T. A zero suffix in this position indicates that the ergative the subject is third person singular he, she, it, the phrase you buy the newspapers for me would translate as zuk e gunkariak arasan diskitazu the auxiliary verb is composed as dzki da zu and means you place do them for me d indicates that the main verb is transitive and in the present tense zki indicates that the direct object is plural Da indicates that the indirect object is me, to me, for me, t becomes da when not final. Zu indicates that the subject is you, plural, the pronoun zuk, you, plural, has the same form both in the nominative or absolutive case, the subject of an intransitive sentence or direct object of a transitive sentence, and in the ergative case, the subject of a transitive sentence. In spoken Basque, the auxiliary verb is never dropped even if it is redundant, e.g. diskitazu in zuk niri egunkariak arasan diskitazu you place are buying the newspapers for me. However, the pronouns are almost always dropped, e.g. zuk in egunkariak arasan diskitazu you place are buying the newspapers for me. The pronouns are used only to show emphasis, egunkariak zuk arasan diskitazu it is you place who buys the newspapers for me, or egunkariak niri arasan diskitazu it is me for whom you buy the newspapers. Modern Basque dialects allow for the conjugation of about 15 verbs, called synthetic verbs, some only in literary contexts. These can be put in the present and past tenses in the indicative and subjunctive moods, in three tenses in the conditional and potential moods, and in one tense in the imperative. Each verb that can be taken and transitively has a nor absolutive paradigm and possibly a nor nori absolutive dative paradigm, as in the sentence ititeri txapela erori zio. The hat fell from grandfather's head. Each verb that can be taken transitively uses those two paradigms for antipassive voice contexts in which no agent is mentioned notice that Basque lacks a passive voice, and displays instead an antipassive voice paradigm, and also has a nor-nork absolutive ergative paradigm and possibly a nor-nori-nork absolutive dative ergative paradigm. The last would entail the diskitazu example above. In each paradigm, each constituent noun can take on any of eight persons, five singular and three plural, with the exception of nor nori nork in which the absolutive can only be third person singular or plural. The most ubiquitous auxiliary, izan, can be used in any of these paradigms, depending on the nature of the main verb. There are more persons in the singular five than in the plural three for synthetic or filamentous verbs because of the two familiar persons, informal masculine and feminine second person singular. The pronoun hi is used for both of them, but where the masculine form of the verb uses a k, the feminine uses an n. This is a property rarely found in Indo-European languages. The entire paradigm of the verb is further augmented by inflecting for listener, the allocutive, even if the verb contains no second-person constituent. If the situation calls for the familiar masculine, the form is augmented and modified accordingly. Likewise for the familiar feminine, 
Gizan bat itori da. A man has come. Gizan bat itori duk. A man has come. You are a male close friend. Gizan bat itori dun. A man has come. You are a female close friend. Gizan bat itori duzu. A man has come. I talk to you, sir, madam. Notice that this nearly multiplies the number of possible forms by three. Still, the restriction on contexts in which these forms may be used is strong, since all participants in the conversation must be friends of the same sex, and not too far apart in age. Some dialects dispense with the familiar forms entirely. Note, however, that the formal second-person singular conjugates in parallel to the other plural forms, perhaps indicating that it was originally the second-person plural, later came to be used as a formal singular, and then later still the modern second-person plural was formulated as an innovation. All the other verbs in Basque are called periphrastic, behaving much like a participle would in English. These have only three forms in total, called aspects, perfect various suffixes, habitual suffix t, z, n, and future, potential suffix, co, go. Verbs of Latinate origin in Basque, as well as many other verbs, have a suffix to in the perfect, adapted from the Latin perfect passive to suffix. The synthetic verbs also have periphrastic forms, for use in perfects and in simple tenses in which they are deponent. Within a verb phrase, the periphrastic verb comes first, followed by the auxiliary. A Basque noun phrase is inflected in 17 different ways for case, multiplied by four ways for its definiteness and number indefinite, definite singular, definite plural, and definite close plural, Euskaldun, Basque speaker, Euskalduna, the Basque speaker, a Basque speaker, Euskaldunic, Basque speakers, the Basque speakers, and Euskaldunak, we Basque speakers, those Basque speakers. These first 68 forms are further modified based on other parts of the sentence, which in turn are inflected for the noun again. It has been estimated that, with two levels of recursion, a Basque noun may have 458,683 inflected forms. When we use cases with a proper name, Mikel, Michael, within a noun phrase, modifying adjectives follow the noun. As an example of a Basque noun phrase, etxe Zaharian, in the old house, is morphologically analyzed as follows by Aguirre et al. Basic syntactic construction is subject-object verb unlike Spanish, French or English where a subject-verb-object construction is more common. The order of the phrases within a sentence can be changed with thematic purposes, whereas the order of the words within a phrase is usually rigid. As a matter of fact, Basque phrase order is topic focus, meaning that in neutral sentences such as sentences to inform someone of a fact or event the topic is stated first, then the focus. In such sentences, the verb phrase comes at the end. In brief, the focus directly precedes the verb phrase. This rule is also applied in questions, for instance, what is this? Can be translated as zir da how, or how zir da, but in both cases the question tag zir immediately precedes the verb da. This rule is so important in Basque that, even in grammatical descriptions of Basque in other languages, the Basque word galdagai focus is used, in negative sentences, the order changes. Since the negative particle ez must always directly precede the auxiliary, the topic most often comes beforehand, and the rest of the sentence follows. This includes the periphrastic, if there is one, itac francesa irikason du. Father teaches French. In the negative becomes itac ez du francesa irikason, in which irikason, teaching, is separated from its auxiliary and placed at the end. Topic. Phonology. Topic. Vowels The Basque language features five vowels, a, e, i, o, and, u, the same that are found in Spanish, Asturian and Aragonese. In the Zuboroan dialect, extra phonemes are featured. The close front rounded vowel, y, graphically represented as eudiaresis. A set of contrasting nasal vowels, indicating a strong influence from Gascon. Topic. Consonants Basque has a distinction between laminal and apical articulation for the alveolar fricatives and affricates. With the laminal alveolar fricative s, the friction occurs across the blade of the tongue, the tongue tip pointing toward the lower teeth. This is the usual s in most European languages. It is written with an orthographic z. 
By contrast, the voiceless apicoalveolar fricative s is written s. The tip of the tongue points toward the upper teeth and friction occurs at the tip apex. For example, zu you singular respectful is distinguished from su fire. The affricate counterparts are written tz and ts. So, et c. The day after tomorrow is distinguished from etsi to give up. Atzo yesterday is distinguished from atzo old woman. In the westernmost parts of the Basque country, only the apical s and the alveolar affricate tz are used. Basque also features postalveolar sibilants, written x, and t, written tx, sounding like English shish and ch. There are two palatal stops, voiced and unvoiced, as well as a palatal nasal and a palatal lateral the palatal stops are not present in all dialects. These and the postalveolar sounds are typical of diminutives, which are used frequently in child language and motherese mainly to show affection rather than size. For example, tanta, drop, versus titanta, kanka, droplet. A few common words, such as texacker, tekor, dog, use palatal sounds even though in current usage they have lost the diminutive sense, the corresponding non-palatal forms now acquiring an augmentative or pejorative sense, zakur, big dog. Many Basque dialects exhibit a derived palatalization effect, in which coronal onset consonants change into the palatal counterpart after the high front vowel, i. For example, the n, in egan, to act, becomes palatal in southern and western dialects when a suffix beginning with a vowel is added, ina. Topic. Ea, the action, eins. Eyes. Doing. The letter J has a variety of realizations according to the regional dialect, J, D, X. As pronounced from west to east in South Biscaya and coastal Lepardi, Central Biscaya, East Biscaya and Givercoa, South Navarre, Inland Lepardi and Low Navarre, and Zubeiroa, respectively. The letter H is silent in the southern dialects, but pronounced although vanishing in the northern ones. Unified Basque spells it except when it is predictable, in a position following a consonant, unless they are recent loanwords e.g. Rwanda, Rwanda, radar. Words may not have initial R. In older loans, initial R took a prosthetic E, resulting in air aroma, Rome, Eruja, Russia, more rarely IRR, for example Arasha, radio, Eriza, rice. Topic. Stress and pitch Basque features great dialectal variation in accentuation, from a weak pitch accent in the western dialects to a marked stress in central and eastern dialects, with varying patterns of stress placement. Stress is in general not distinctive, and for historical comparisons not very useful. There are, however, a few instances where stress is phonemic, serving to distinguish between a few pairs of stress-marked words and between some grammatical forms, mainly plurals from other forms, e.g. basoa, the forest, absolutive case, versus basoa, the glass, absolutive case, an adoption from Spanish vaso, basoque, the forest, ergative case, versus basoque, the glass. Ergative case versus basoque, the forests, or the glasses, absolutive case. Given its great deal of variation among dialects, stress is not marked in the standard orthography and Uskaltz India the Academy of the Basque Language provides only general recommendations for a standard placement of stress, basically to place a high-pitched weak stress weaker than that of Spanish, let alone that of English on the second syllable of a syntagma, and a low-pitched even weaker stress on its last syllable, except in plural forms where stress is moved to the first syllable. This scheme provides Basque with a distinct musicality that differentiates its sound from the prosodical patterns of Spanish which tends to stress the second to last syllable. Some use called in Beriac, new Basque speakers, i.e. second language Basque speakers with Spanish as their first language tend to carry the prosodical patterns of Spanish into their pronunciation of Basque, e.g. pronouncing Nair Ama, my mom, as Nair Ama, instead of as Nire Ama, backquote. Topic. Morphophonology The combining forms of nominals in final, u, vary across the regions of the Basque country. The, u, can stay unchanged, be lowered to an, a, or it can be lost. 
Loss is most common in the east, while lowering is most common in the west. For instance, buru head, has the combining forms buru and bur, as in buruko cap, and burko pillow, whereas katu cat, has the combining form kata, as in katakum kitten. Michelina suggests that the lowering to a is generalized from cases of romance borrowings in Basque that retained romance stem alternations, such as cantu song. With combining form kanta, borrowed from romance kanto, kanta. Topic. Vocabulary Through contact with neighboring peoples, Basque has adopted many words from Latin, Spanish, and Gascon, among other languages. There are a considerable number of Latin loans, sometimes obscured by being subject to Basque phonology and grammar for centuries, for example, lore. Flower". From florum, erota, mill. From rotum, mill, wheel. Gela, room. From selum, gauza, thing. From causa. Topic: <laughs> Writing system. Basque is written using the Latin script, including mu and sometimes c and u. Basque does not use cc, qq, vv, ww, yy for words that have some tradition in this language. Nevertheless, the Basque alphabet established by India does include them for loanwords a b flat cc and, as a variant, cc d d e f f g g h h e j j k k l l m n n n u p p q q r r s s t t u u v v w w x x y y z z t h e phonetically meaningful digraphs d d l l r r t s t t t x t z are treated as pairs of letters. All letters and digraphs represent unique phonemes. The main exception is when L and N are preceded by I, that in most dialects palatalizes their sound into and even if these are not written. Hence, Ikirinya can also be written Ikirina without changing the sound, whereas the proper name Ainhoa requires the mute H to break the palatalization of the N. H is mute in most regions, but it is pronounced in many places in the northeast, the main reason for its existence in the Basque alphabet. Its acceptance was a matter of contention during the standardization process because the speakers of the most extended dialects had to learn where to place these H's, silent for them. In Sabino Arana's alphabet, digraphs LL and RR were replaced with L and R, respectively. A typically Basque style of lettering is sometimes used for inscriptions. It derives from the work of stone and wood carvers and is characterized by thick serifs. Topic number system used by Miller's Basque Miller's traditionally employed a separate number system of unknown origin. In this system the symbols are arranged either along a vertical line or horizontally. On the vertical line the single digits and fractions are usually off to one side, usually at the top. When used horizontally, the smallest units are usually on the right and the largest on the left. The system is, as is the Basque system of counting in general, vigesimal. Although the system is in theory capable of indicating numbers above 100, most recorded examples do not go above 100 in general. Fractions are relatively common, especially one half. The exact systems used vary from area to area but generally follow the same principle with five usually being a diagonal line or a curve off the vertical line a V-shape is used when writing a five horizontally. Units of ten are usually a horizontal line through the vertical. The twenties are based on a circle with intersecting lines. This system is no longer in general use but is occasionally employed for decorative purposes. Topic examples Topic Article 1 of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights Topic Esclabu Ermintaria Topic See also Basque dialects Vasconic languages List of Basques Basque country Late Basquization languages of France Languages of Spain Aquitanian language Wiktionary, Swadesh List of Basque words Topic Notes Topic Further reading Topic General and descriptive grammars Allières, Jacques 1979, Manuel Préic de Basque, Connaissance des Longs V. 13, A and J. Picard Paris, ISBN 2-7084-0038-X, de Azcu Aberasturi, Resurrecion Maria 1969, Morphologia Vasca. La Gran Encyclopedia Vasca, Bilbao 1969. Campion, Arturo 1884, Grammatica de los Cuatro Dialectos Literarios de la Lengua Euscara, Toulouse. 
Uskara Institutua 1, University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu, Sereco Euskal Grammatica, Seg 2, Hualde, José Ignacio and Ortiz de Urbina, John eds, A Grammar of Basque. Berlin, Mouton de Gruyter, 2003. ISBN 3-11-017683-1. King, Alan R. 1994. The Basque Language, A Practical Introduction. Reno, University of Nevada Press. ISBN 0-87417-155-5. Lafitte, Pierre Grammaire Basque, Navarro Labordon Literaire. Elkerlanian, Donostia, Bayonne, ISBN 2-913156-10x, Dialectal, Laffin, R. 1972, Basque. In Thomas A. Seaboke, ed., Current Trends in Linguistics. Volume 9. Linguistics in Western Europe, Mouton, The Hague, Mouton, pp. 1744-1792, de Rijk, Rudolf P. G. 2007, Standard Basque, A Progressive Grammar, Current Studies in Linguistics Volume 1, The MIT Press, Cambridge, Massachusetts, ISBN 0-262-04242-8 Tovar, Antonio, 1957, The Basque Language, U of Pennsylvania Press, Philadelphia. Uhlenbeck, C. 1947. La langue basque et la linguistique générale. Lingua. I. 59-76. doi. 10.1016-0024-3841-49-90045-5. Urquizu Shirashua, Patricio. 2007, Grammatica de la lengua vasca. UNED, Madrid, ISBN 978-84-362-3442-8, Van Ice, Willem J. 1879, Grammaire Comparé des Dialectes Basques, Paris. Topic Linguistic Studies Aguirre, Eneco, et al., 1992, XUXEN, a spelling checker, corrector for Basque based on two-level morphology. Gavel, Henri 1921, Elements de Phonetic Basque Topic Revista Internacional de los Estudios Vascos Review Internacional des Etudes Basques 12, Paris, Study of the Dialects, Hualde, José Ignacio 1991, Basque Phonology, Taylor & Francis, ISBN 978-0-415-05655-7. La Cara Andrinua, Joseba A., Hualde, José Ignacio eds. 2006, Studies in Basque and Historical Linguistics in Memory of R. L. Trask, R. L. Trask and Oroitsa Penitan Ikerketak Euskalaritzas Eta Hiskonsalaritza Historicoas, equals Anuario del Seminario de Filología Vasca Julio de Urquillo, International Journal of Basque Linguistics and Philology Vol. 40, No. 1-2, San Sebastián. La Cara, J. and Ortiz de Urbina, J. E. D. S. 1992, Syntactic Theory and Basque Syntax, Givercoaco Foru Aldundia, Donostia San Sebastian, ISBN 978-84-7907-094-6. Orduña Aznar, Eduardo, 2005. Sobra algunos possibles numerales en textos ibericos. Palea Hispanica 5-491-506. This fifth volume of the journal Palea Hispanica consists of Acta Palea Hispanica X, the Proceedings of the Ninth Conference on Paleo-Hispanic Studies, de Rijk, R. 1972, Studies in Basque Syntax, Relative Clauses Ph.D. Dissertation, MIT, Cambridge, Massachusetts, USA. Uhlenbeck, C.C. Contribution à une phonétique comparative des dialectes basques, Revista internationale de los estudios vascos equals Revue internationale des études basques 3, 3 pp. 465-503-4-4 pp. 65-120. Zuazo, Koldo, 2008, Euskalkiak, Euskaran Dialectok. Elkar. ISBN 978-84-9783-626-5. Hualde, José Ignacio, Lujanbayo, Oihana, Zabiri, Juan Jox 2010, Goizueta Basque PDF, Journal of the International Phonetic Association, doi, 10.1017, so 025100309990260 Topic Lexicons Alestia, Gorka Basque English Dictionary University of Nevada Press, Reno, ISBN 0-87417-126-1. 
Alestia, Gorka and White, Linda 1990, English Basque Dictionary, University of Nevada Press, Reno, ISBN 0-87417-156-3. Ascu Aberasturi, Resurrección Maria de 1905, Diccionario Vasco Español Francés, Guthner, Bilbao, Paris reprinted many times. Luis Mitexelina, Diccionario General Vasco, Oratorico Euskal Histogia, 16 vols. Real Academia de la Lengua Vasca, Bilbao 1987 ff. ISBN 84-271-1493-1. Morris, Mikel 1998, Morris Student Euskara Ingelisa Basque English Dictionary, Claudio Harlexit Fundazioa, Donostia Sarasola, Ibon 2010, Igungo Euskararan Histogia EEH 5, Bilbo, Euskara Institutua 6, The University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu Sarasola, Ibon 2010, Zihaski 7, Bilbo, Euskara Institutua 8, The University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu Soda, M. de la, et al., 1976 6, Diccionario Retana de Autoridades de la Lengua Vasca, Conscientos de Miles de Nuevas Voces y Excepciones, Antigas y Modernas, Bilbao, La Gran Encyclopedia Vasca. ISBN 84-248-0248-9. Van Eyce, W.J. 1873. Dictionnaire Basque Francais. Paris, London, Maisonneuve, Williams and Norgate. Topic Basque Corpora Sarasola, Ibon, Pelo Salaburu, Josu Landa 2011, etc., Igungo Testuan Corpuese 9, Bilbo, Euskara Institutua 10, The University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu 11, Sarasola, Ibon, Pelo Salaburu, Josu Landa 2009, Eriduko Prosa Gaur, EPG 12, Bilbo, Euskara Institutua 13, The University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu 14, Sarasola, Ibon, Pelo Salaburu, Josu Landa 2009, Eriduko Prosa Dynamicoa, EPD 15, Bilbo, Euskara Institutua 16, The University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu 17, Sarasola, Ibon, Pelo Salaburu, Josu Landa 2013, Euskal Klasikoan Corpuese, EKC 18, Bilbo, Euskara Institutua 19, The University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu 20, Sarasola, Ibon, Pelo Salaburu, Josu Landa 2014, Genkale Corpuese 21, Bilbo, Euskara Institutua 22, The University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu 23, Sarasola, Ibon, Pelo Salaburu, Josu Landa 2010, Pensamendwaran Klasico Corpuese 24, Bilbo, Euskara Institutua 25, The University of the Basque Country UPV, Ehu 26 Topic Other Aguirre Sarando, Antexon, 1988 Tratado de Molinologia, Los Molinos and Gapuzcoa. San Sebastián, Yusco y Cascunza Sociedad de Estudios Vascos. Fundación Miguel de Barandiaran. Bacher, Peter A Basque Nautical Pigeon, A Missing Link in the History of Fu. Journal of Pigeon and Creole Languages, 2 1, 1 1-30. doi, 10.1075, JPCL, 2.1.02bak. Bacher, Peter, et al., 1991. Basque Pigeons in Iceland and Canada. Anejos del Anuario del Seminario de Filología Vasca Julio de Urquillo, 23. Dean, Nicolas Gerard Hendrick, 1937. Glossaria duo Vasco Islandica. Amsterdam. Reprinted 1991 in Anuario del Seminario de Filología Vasca Julio de Urquillo, 25, 2, 321-426. Hualde, José Ignacio Icelandic Basque Pigeon. Journal of Basque Studies in America. 541-59. History of the language and etymologies Aguirrezable, Lore, 2003. Aramintexela, Euskal Agitoan Hizkira. San Sebastián, Argia. Azurmendi, Jocks, die Bedudung der Sprache in Renaissance und Reformation und die Entstehung der Baskischen Literatur im Religiosen und Politischen Konfliktgebiet zwischen Spanien und Frankreich in, Wolfgang W. Molliken Herausgeber, Peter J. Weber Herausgeber, Neue Forschungsarbeiten zur Kontaktlinguistik, Bonn, Dummler, 1997. ISBN 978-3537864192 Hualde, José Ignacio, Lacara, Joseba A. and R. L. 
Trask eds. 1996, Towards a History of the Basque Language, Current Issues in Linguistic Theory 131, John Benjamin Publishing Company, Amsterdam, ISBN 978-1-55619-585-3. Michelina, Luis, 1990. Phonetica Historica Vasca. Bilbao. ISBN 84 7907 016 1. Laffin, Rene. 1944, Le Systeme du Verbe Basque au XVIE siècle, Delmas, Bordeaux. Lopelman, Martin. 1968, Etymologisches Wörterbuch der Baskischen Sprache. Dialecta von Laberd, Nieder Navarra und La Sol, 2 Bde, de Gruder, Berlin Non-Standard Etymologies, Idiosyncratic. Orpustin, J. B. La Long Basque au Moyen Age. Bigori, ISBN 2-909262-22-7. Pagola, Rosa Murin, 1984. Euskakis Euskalki. Vittoria Gastes, Eusko Jarlaritzerin Argidulp. Rolfs, Gerhard, 1980. Le Gascon, Etudes de Philologie Pyrenean. Zeitschrift für Romanische Philologie 85. Trask, R. L., History of Basque. New York, London, Routledge, 1996. ISBN 0-415-13116-2. Trask, R. L. Edited by Max W. Wheeler 2008, Etymological Dictionary of Basque, University of Sussex Unfinished. Also, some important Basque words and a bit of culture. 27. Zuazo, Coldo, 2010. El Euskara y sus dialectos. Albertania. ISBN 978-84-9868-202-1. Topic relationship to other languages. Topic general reviews of the theories. Jacobson, William H. Jr., 1999. Basque language origin theories. In Basque Cultural Studies, edited by William A. Douglas, Carmelo Urza, Linda White, and Jose Bazuleka, 27-43. Basque Studies Program Occasional Papers Series, No. 5. Reno, Basque Studies Program, University of Nevada, Reno. La Cara Andrinua, Joseba, 1998, His Kunt Comparatua Eta Itziniascarren Eroa in Basque, Ustero 25, pp. 47 110, includes review of older theories. La Cara Andrinua, Joseba, 1999, Na de Na in Basque, Ustero 31, pp. 15 84. Morvan, Michel, 1996. The Linguistic Origins of Basque in French. Bordeaux, Presses Universitaires. pp. 25-95. Trask, R. L. Origin and Relatives of the Basque Language, Review of the Evidence in Towards a History of the Basque Language, ed. J. Hualde, J. Lacara, R. L. Trask, John Benjamins, Amsterdam, Philadelphia. Trask, R. L. History of Basque. New York, London, Routledge, 1996. ISBN 0-415-13116-2, pp. 358-414. Afroasiatic hypothesis Schuckhardt, Hugo Baskisch Hamitisch Wortvergleichungen. Revista Internacional de Estudios Vascos equals. Review Internacional des Etudes Basques. 7 to 289 minus 340. Mukarovsky, Hans Genter, 1964-66. Les rapports du Basque et du Berber. Comptes rendus du GLECS Groupe linguistique d'études chimito sémitiques 10 to 177 minus 184. Mukarovsky, Hans Genter, 1972. El Vascunes y el Berber. Euskara, 17 to 5 minus 48. Trombetti, Alfredo, 1925. La origine della lingua basca, Bologna, New Edit. ISBN 978-88-271-0062-2. Topic: Dene Caucasian hypothesis. Benson, John D., 1999. The comparison of Basque and North Caucasian in mother tongue. Journal of the Association for the Study of Language in Prehistory. Gloucester, Mass. Benson, John D. 2003. Notes on Basque Comparative Phonology. PDF. Mother Tongue. 8, 23-39.
Benson, John D. 2004. Some features of Dean Caucasian phonology with special reference to Basque. Cahiers de l'Institut de Linguistique de Louvain, 30.4, pp. 33-54. Benson, John D. 2006. Materials for a Comparative Grammar of the Dean Caucasian, Sino -Caucasian Languages. There is also a preliminary draft. Benson, John D. 1997, Review of The History of Basque. London, Routledge, 1997. PP XXII 458 by RL Trask Benson John D 1996 A final response to the Basque debate in mother tongue 1 Trask RL 1995 Basque and Dean Caucasian a critique from the Basque side Mother tongue 1 to 3-82 Topic Caucasian hypothesis Buda, Carl. 1950. Leoscaro Caucasique. Bulletin de la Real Sociedad Vasca de Amigos del Pais. Homenaje a D. Julio de Arquillo e Ibarra, Vol. 3, San Sebastián, pp. 207 232. Klimov, Georgij A. 1994, Einfering in die Kaukasische Sprachwissenschaft, Busk, Hamburg, ISBN 3 87548 060 0, pp. 208 215. Laffin, Rene. 1951. Concordances morphologiques entre la Basque et les langues caucasiques. Word, 7 3, 227 244. Doi 10.1080/0043795.1951.1165940 Laffin, René. Etudes Basques et Caucasiques. Word 8 to 80-94. Doi 10.1080/0043795.1961.1165940. Laffin, René. 1952. Trombetti, Alfredo. 1925. La origine della lingua basca. Bologna. New edit. ISBN 978-88-271-0062-2. Michelina, Luis. 1968. Leoscaro Caucasian. In Martinet, A. Ed. La Language. Paris. Pp. 1414-1437. Criticism. Uhlenbeck, Christian Cornelius. 1924. De la possibilité de un parenté entre la Basque et les langues caucasiques. Revista Internacional de los Estudios Vascos equals Review Internacional des Etudes Basques 15, pp. 565 to 588. Zelikov, Mixel. 2005. La hypothèse basco caucasienne dans les travaux de N. Mar. Cahiers de Lielsel, N. Degree 20, pp. 363-381 In Russian, Zykar Uvo Rodstvi Baskskogo Azika S. Kopkazoskimi. Viprozi Azikaznin. 1955. 5. Topic. Iberian Hypothesis Barr, Gerhard. Baskish und Iberisch. Yusko Jakinza 2, pp. 3-20, 167-194, Goro Kategui, Joaquin La onomastica aquitana y su relacion con la ibérica, lengua y cultura en Hispania preromana, actas del v coloquio sobre lenguas y culturas de la península ibérica, Colonia 25-28 de noviembre de 1989 Francisco Vr and Jürgen Unterman, eds, ISBN 84-7481-736-6, pp. 609-634. Rodriguez Ramos, Jesus. 2002. La hypothesis del vascoiberismo deste el punto de vista de la epigrafia ibera, Fontes Linguae Vasconum, Studia et Documenta, 90, pp. 197 218, ISSN 0046435X. Schuckhart, Hugo Ernst Mario. 1907, Die Iberische Declination, Wien. Uralic Altaic Hypothesis 
Bonaparte, Louis Lucien, 1862, Long Basque et Longs Finnesses, London. Morvan, Michel, 1996, The Linguistic Origins of Basque in French. Bordeaux, Presses Universitaires. ISBN 2-86781-182-1. Vasconic Old European Hypothesis Venman, Theo 2003, Europa Vasconica, Europa Semitica, Trends in Linguistics. Studies and Monographs 138, De Gruyter, Berlin, ISBN 978-3-11-017054-2. Venman, Theo 2007. Baskin wie wir, Linguistisches und Genetisches zum Europäischen Stammbaum. Biologenhut 5 6 6-11. Topic. Other theories Thornton, R. W. 2002, Basque Parallels to Greenberg's Eurasiatic, in, Mother Tongue. Gloucester, Mass., 2002. Topic. External links Official website, Euskaltsa India the Royal Academy of the Basque Language Euskara Institutua, the University of the Basque Country, UPV, AHU Basque, a mystery language YouTube